Okay, this is an intro to the use and operation of a rotational gripper. Uh, basically, a rotational gripper is just like it sounds, it's something that rotates. Uh, the gripper part is this channel here, and what happens is, is this lock goes down onto the string and holds it. Now, to get that lock to move down, you have to actually put the string around the gripper once and then into it. You can't just put it straight into it like that. Okay, and you'll you'll see how that works if you put the string around like this and you pull, see how the gripper goes down? Okay, when the string start or when the rotator starts to move back, it's going to both pull the string and lock it down in place at the same time. It's it's, it's pretty smart. Um, but you, you kind of get the idea so far. What you do is you take the string that you want to tension, you put it around it. Don't pull it too tight because if you do, you'll close the, the gripper before you get around. Okay? So just loosely go around, put the string through, and if you want, you can pull it tight, but you, you really don't have to. You shouldn't have to. But once you come back around, you engage it, whether with the, with the foot actuator or with the button on the machine. You engage it, and it'll spin, and then it's tensioned. Now you can see this one is a constant pull because it's twisting and constantly adjusting the tension as the string elongates or relaxes rather. And uh, once you're ready to go, once you're ready to let it go, you hit it again and all comes undone. And you're ready to move on to the next one. That's it. Thank you.